doing today? Hope everybody's doing good. Um, I'm just working here in my kitchen. I made some soup for lunch, and it's all done. It's just, it's just in the pot now. Uh, actually, we already had lunch, and it's cooling down. But I also boiled some eggs, and gonna make some deviled eggs. So I thought, you know, why not hop on here and talk a little bit while I'm doing this. Um, you don't have to watch it. You can click right on off because I know I'm, I can get pretty boring sometimes, but, um, how things going for y'all today? My name's Jackie. Welcome to my channel. If it's your first time hopping on, um, uh, coming in and, and visiting, uh, I hope you'll hang around, hit the subscribe button and keep coming back. Because I do a little bit of everything on here. Anyway, back to what I was doing. Um, like I said, thought I'd make some deviled eggs. Uh, I haven't talked much about what I've been doing lately. Uh, just little bits and pieces. Uh, about two weeks ago, I decided to hop on the wagon and try to do... Um, low carb it wasn't working for me because my cravings were horrible because i ate sweets quite a bit while i was with stacy in florida um if you're new to my channel my daughter stacy had to have a uh, liver transplant she had it in december of last year and she almost died uh with from com complications and she's doing better now. She's doing very well. Anyway, uh, she still gets tired easy and still has a lot of pain with her neuropathy and stuff and doesn't get around very well uh, unless she's on her pain medications. And they just changed it, so she's going through some, some um, readjusting, I guess you'd call it. Anyway... She's doing good. But uh, about two weeks ago, I, I thought, well, I'm, i got to get back on my low carb because I don't like gaining weight. And it's easy to gain, especially at our, you know, when you get my age. And um, so I wasn't having much luck with it. <clears throat> and I had been watching Dr. Barry and uh, his wife, I think, I think you pronounce her name, Nasha. Y'all know I can't pronounce it. I'll put their names on the screen. Anyway, they they were talking, uh, answering questions about the uh, carnivore. I think that's how you say that. And uh, how it would help with the cravings. And it would take uh, a good two weeks or longer to really get the cravings gone. And... Uh, I decided to give it a try because <laughs> I needed to get control of uh, the cravings. Um, I got my eggs all separated. Um, right now I'm just mashing up my, my yolks before I add anything in. Uh, I'm going to be using Duke's mayonnaise. There's um, zero carbs. Uh, if you have a soy problem, you don't want to use this because it does have soybean oils in it. And I'm using mustard, which is carb-free. And I am going to use just a little bit of dill relish. It's not sweet. Um, has one, uh, less than one carb, um, if you can see it right there i can't really tell where i'm aiming because i got y'all aiming down at what i'm doing i'm going to put pepper in it and i'm also going to use um some himalayan uh sea salt i'm hoping eventually to get the uh redmond's salt but right now this is what i have Okay, back to what I was saying, now that I told you what I'm doing. <laughs> um, 
I decided to, 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 to just give it a try. I mean, you know, the first day, oh, it was a nightmare. And uh, it was rough. But I got through it. And the second day was better. Uh, third day, oh, another nightmare day. It's weird because it was like that uh, for two weeks. Because it's been, I started on the 13th of October. So it's been a little bit. Um, and, it, and it was just like up and down with the cravings. And um, I stayed, most of my were under 20 carbs. I very seldom had more than that. Uh, I don't think I did up until yesterday and the day before. I I went up a little bit on carbs, uh, but it wasn't candy. It was, uh, I had a little fruit and uh, that was supposed to be sugar-free, but, you know, and it was, but it still had some carbs in it and I counted them. And um, then... And that was, that was that. Now, I don't measure my stuff. I just put it in. And if I, if I need more, I add it. Um, I'm, I love yellow mustard, so I do have a habit of getting heavy on that. So I have to be careful. <laughs> um, you know, so I start out with just a small amount of that. But, needless to say, thanks to... Eggs and meat, and I haven't been strict carnivore. Let's be honest. I, I, I am not one that can be strict carnivore. I don't want to be strict carnivore. I guess is what I'm saying. Uh, but I needed that to get me off of the sugar cravings, and it did. Thank you, Jesus. Um, I, um, I don't eat the sugar now. I don't feel that I need it, and hopefully. <laughs> I'll stick to it, but the reason I don't talk much about it on my channel, I used one tablespoon of the um, the dill relish because I don't want to overpower it. The reason I don't talk about uh, low carb and stuff on my channel much is because if I don't stick to it, that's my business, and I don't need people hopping on and and, and saying anything bad, which I haven't had that problem yet. Again, thank you, Jesus. I know a lot of people that, that do have that problem, you know, but so far, I haven't. But I don't get out there and, you know, my channel's not that big. I mean, I don't even have a thousand people, which is fine. But if I get to a thousand, I can do some lives. Um, but I just, I just, you know, thought I would share with you guys what I've been doing. Uh, I still buy candy for my husband. I buy it for Hayden. Um, we take, you know, so that I have it. And I have candy in the house if I want it. I'll eat it. But I guarantee you, I will count everything that goes in this girl's mouth. Uh, I'm happy to say I have lost, uh, eight pounds, nine pounds. So it is working for me. What I'm doing is working. So I'm going to keep it up. And um, see where it takes me, you know. Who knows? By the time the holidays get here, maybe I'll be completely off carnivore. I'm just trying to work myself into a routine and not shocking myself all at once. But I have been watching a lot of channels that... I really enjoy, so that's helped me too. Anyway, I got this mixed up. Let me taste it and make sure I don't need anything. That's perfect. I think my husband will like that. I know I do. Okay. Let me get my spoon. does taste a little mustardy <laughs> like I said I have a I like mustard so I have a little bit of a heavy hand on the mustard I like I said just thought I'd hop on and bring you guys along 
uh, while I was making my eggs and just visit a little bit and tell you what I'm doing to maybe help my health be better. Uh, they said it will help with arthritis, uh, the carnivore diet and the low carb or keto. I have arthritis in my lower back. Um, sometimes it gets really bad when the weather's changing. I have arthritis in my hips. At times it's bad enough to where it's hard to sit. I can only sit for a short time and then I have to stand up for a little bit and then I can sit back down. Um, I try not to take any medications for it yet. Doctor did want ask me about going and seeing um, uh, a rheumatologist. I'm not ready for that yet because I know when I go, first thing they're going to do is put you on pills. And I'm just, if I can stay off of them, I want to. I just deal with it and I, I take uh, Tylenol when it gets really bad. So, anyway, y'all, that's what's been going on with me. Hope everybody else is doing good. I I got my second part to my journal uh, ready to uh, go up. It'll be going up either you, either it's going to go up and you've already seen it by the time you see this, or you'll see it. Um, I don't have any paprika, or I would top these uh, with paprika. A lot of people do. Um, I think my daughter. Angie might have borrowed it while I was in Florida and I haven't I haven't replaced it yet it's not something I use a lot and these eggs are just for me and my husband so they don't need anything special now if I was going somewhere and taking a plate of eggs I would definitely purchase the um, paprika just to kind to to top to where it would have a little bit of a pretty look to it so anyway that's pretty much where I am. I just wanted to hop on and basically say hi and talk for a minute, tell you guys what I'm doing, and I hope y'all have a good weekend. I hope it's a blessed weekend, and uh, I'm going to try and stick to what I'm doing, and uh, I'm not one that's going to get on the scales in front of you guys to prove a point. And it ain't going to happen. You guys know what I look like. You'll be able to tell if I'm sticking to it or not. And if I don't stick to it, there again, that's my business, right? I just I just wanted to share. Because maybe if you guys uh, pray with me, I'll be able to stick to it. Okay, I'm going to get off of here. I hope y'all have a blessed day. A blessed weekend. Don't forget to smile. And I will have... A Dollar Tree and a Walmart haul coming up because I have been doing a little shopping at the Dollar Tree but didn't have enough to show but uh, by tomorrow I'll have a Dollar Tree haul for y'all and I'll catch y'all in the next video God bless big smile coming your way and I'll catch you soon bye y'all